Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Quaish, and I'm so happy to be back on my channel with a new video. So today I just missed one of the most special class of mine, that is lab diagnosis. Just because I badly felt sharing this video, because I myself am not going through a very great phase right now. But um, the, I'm grateful that my family and my close friends are there to support me, to constantly guide me. And that is why I felt that uh, I need to share this video on my channel for you people, for the people out there who feel alone, lonely in a crowd of 100 people that um, who feel um, left out, who feel that uh, there's no one to talk to, they cannot share their feelings with anyone or uh, there's no one to guide them. So I'm going to talk about a uh, few points in this video that will help you out, overcome this feeling of uh, fear of missing out and um, how to find happiness because that's the most important thing in your life that's the essence of your life and uh, i'll try my best to explain you and guide you whatever i have experienced myself and um, because i personally know the phase when you feel left out when you feel that your world is over when you feel that uh, when you feel so lost and uh, the time when you feel that there are everything whatever you're doing or whatever is happening to you is happening against of your will that's the worst part of your life and uh, i just wanted to be there for you in that case i just wanted to be that support system so that you don't feel that there's no one to guide you a very special video and just coming out from my heart happiness for some people can be as small as sipping a cup of coffee with their loved ones and talking about life and for some people meaning of happiness can be traveling having fun and partying so this basically signifies that everyone has their own definition of happiness their own meaning of happiness but have you ever wondered have you ever asked yourself that what real happiness is i mean for yourself have you ever wondered that why you feel so alone and lonely even in the group of 100 of people and sometimes you feel so fulfilled when you're sitting alone in a room maybe you never realized that the real happiness was always within you you just fail to recognize you just fail to cherish it while you were out there pleasing those people who don't even care about you you know what that your fun your happiness was unknowingly restricted by those people who are around you being you is amazing it's unimaginably fun you know you just try to be the person that people wants to see and in that process you lose yourself you know what why am i talking about finding yourself finding happiness all together because the day when you will find yourself you'll know your worth that day will be the day when you'll realize this thing that, that the happiness which you were finding in other people was always inside you it resides inside you it was always inside you you settled for less you lowered your expectations for those people who don't even care who don't deserve your love your investment and your affection okay those people who left you at your worst phase who didn't even understand who didn't even care how would you feel how would you suffer you don't deserve that kind of love my darling you can't just give keep on giving them your best while all they're doing is breaking you in pieces that would be so unfair for you that would be unfair for you not for anyone just for you and you are the most important person in your life because so because even if people will stay or not you have to stay with yourself realize this thing you are not a failure just because you didn't pass an exam you are not an option just because it's not convenient for them right now you are not a second choice you are not a maybe understand that you are an absolute yes maybe not for them because it's not convenient for them right now for other people there are there's just not one person in this world my darling there are million of people okay don't lower your expectations for those people who don't understand your worth who don't value you it took me a long time to realize that never ever chase a thing that doesn't want you equally okay that in their life you are not as equal equally important as they are in your life don't chase that thing because if that thing really belong to you, you at first place there would have been no need of chasing it at all okay 
always remember that if you are begging for something that thing was never yours so please do mercy on yourself okay by not hurting yourself again and again so there is this one point of keeping a mentality of it is what it is okay you can't control it you can't change it let it be you know what if you have put a lot of investment your time and you've worked really hard in it and in return you are not getting a penny you are not getting anything it's not meant for you my darling it is not meant for you if it was for you you would have known way sooner you would have known way sooner so the another point is start working on detachment the idea of attaching yourself to a certain extent that Uh, the specific thing decides your mood is so toxic and trust me that thing is not toxic you are toxic for yourself okay you are very much toxic for yourself if that specific thing is uh, deciding your mood it means that you are so powerless okay you are so powerless you don't have that power in yourself to control your mood in order to detach yourself from things from people you need to realize a lot of things on your own you need to understand this thing that attachments will lead you nowhere most it can do is depress yourself and you just got one life my love don't destroy it don't destroy it just make it count